We continue our Sector News TV Entrepreneur Training Series with our product development topic with marketing strategies for startups. Please don't forget to like our video and subscribe to our channel so that this kind of free training series that will make a difference in your personal development can continue. For startups, product development is the foundation of their business. Successful product development can help startups build a sustainable business model and gain a competitive advantage in the market. In this article, we will discuss the steps and considerations that startups should follow for a successful product development process, identify your business goals, a successful product development process starts with identifying your business goals. Determine what problems your product will solve and what benefits it will provide. You also need to define your target market and target customers. This information will guide you through the product development process, conduct research. One of the key steps in the product development process is to conduct research. Study your competitors and other products in the market. Identify the needs and expectations of your target customers. Get and analyze customer feedback. These steps will help you design your product according to your customers' needs and expectations. Creating an MVP or prototype or test product is the next step in the product development process. The MVP should be a simple product where you can collect your customers' feedback on your product. The MVP will help you test the functionality and user experience of your product. Evaluate feedback, share the MVP with your customers and get their feedback. Feedback can provide important clues to improve your product. Analyze this feedback and make the necessary changes to improve your product. Define your marketing strategy. Once your product is ready, you can start defining your marketing strategy. Determine a marketing strategy that suits your target audience and the benefits of your product. This strategy should be designed to promote your product to your target audience and differentiate your product in the market. You can use different marketing techniques such as content marketing, social media marketing, and influencer marketing. Keep improving your product. The product development process is never complete. Customer feedback and market changes may indicate that you need to continuously improve your product. Continuously updating and improving your product will help you always provide the best experience to your customers. In conclusion, the product development process is vital for a successful startup. Set your business goals, conduct research, create the MVP, evaluate feedback, determine your marketing strategy and continuously improve your product. These steps will help your startup succeed in the product development process, marketing strategies for startups customer discovery. Customer discovery is one of the cornerstones of a startup's marketing strategy. A successful marketing strategy starts with understanding your target audience and customers. Therefore, the customer discovery process helps you better understand your business's target audience and understand their needs and wants. Here are the steps to follow in the customer discovery process for startups. Identify your target audience. The first step in the customer discovery process is to identify your target audience. By identifying your target audience, you can understand which customers need your product, who uses similar products and which market segments might be interested in your product. By conducting customer research, you can learn more about your target audience. You can conduct customer surveys, focus groups, and customer interviews to understand customers' needs, expectations, and aspirations. In the process, you can learn what kind of product or service you need to develop to provide solutions to your customers' problems. Analyzing your competitors will help you understand which products your target customers prefer and why they prefer them. By examining the features, prices, marketing strategies, and customer service of your competitors' products, you Determine how you can differentiate your product from your competitors. Minimum viable product MVP is the process of creating a prototype to understand what your product can offer your customers. MVP allows your customers to experience your product and allows you to get customer feedback. MVP helps you optimize your product according to your customers' needs. Determine your marketing strategy. Once the customer discovery process is complete, you need to determine your marketing strategy. Identifying where your target audience is and how you can reach them is important to determine how much of your marketing budget you should spend and where. 
By identifying the social media platforms that your business target audience is interested in, you can use your advertising budget there. You can also use influencer marketing and referral marketing to develop effective marketing strategies. During the customer discovery process, you need to focus on the needs of your customers and optimize your product according to their needs. It is also important to collect customer feedback and ensure customer satisfaction. Your customer's feedback can help you develop and improve your product. Customer satisfaction is one of the most important factors that determine the success of a startup. As a result, a startup's marketing strategy starts with knowing its target audience well and understanding their needs. The customer discovery process helps you identify these needs and develop a product or service. The MVP creation process helps optimize your product according to your customer's needs. To determine your marketing strategy, identify where your target audience is and how you can reach them and adjust your marketing budget accordingly. Also, collecting customer feedback and ensuring customer satisfaction is important for a successful startup. Also, don't forget to visit sectornews.com and subscribe to our channel. Our next topic is marketing strategies for startups and growth strategies.